So, you are here. needle pulling thread. What's that? A needle pulling thread. That's what so is. You're a needle pulling thread. So, last time on Lay Wizards. <laughs> Did you give up on streaming? I am streaming it right now. Yeah. <laughs> Take two. Yes, I gave up. <laughs> um. Anyway, so last last time, uh, you all were tasked uh, by Lady Rose to look into uh, some Agamid barbarians who are out in the mountains attacking trade caravans coming into the city, on account of the city is not self sufficient enough to really you know not rely on trade so trade stuff getting attacked is bad yeah but anyway um so you guys went out uh you took uh captain vozlov with you uh on account of her being a a skilled survivalist type and b someone who can speak on behalf of lady rose um, and you guys, you went out to one of the attacks, and you uh, you were able to track uh, a group of, of Agamids back toward the mountains. However, you were ambushed by bandits. Um, but also, however, you guys fought off the ambush, and um, as a couple of the bandits tried to run away, a group of Agamid warriors took out the bandits, and uh, they made contact with you and said... Their chief wishes to speak with you. And I believe that is where we left off. Um, so, yeah. <laughs> what are you guys doing? Rollicking towards the chief. <laughs> <laughs> Going to see the chief. And we're gonna get married. I'm hoping we're going to see the wizard, the wonderful wizard of Oz. <laughs> the wonderful wizard of yeah. Anyway. Oh yeah. And you guys captured two of the bandits in the ensuing brawl. The rest of them all get killed. Oh yeah, I think your your out water elementals aren't aren't there anymore, but <laughs> they just showed up and beat the fuck out of things. Um <laughs> But yeah, so you guys are just gonna gonna follow the Agamids back. Yeah. <laughs> All right. They're not making any requests, like you know, dropping weapons or anything crazy, right? No, no, they're just like, then, hey, yeah. follow us. Try to keep up. <laughs> um, so yeah, you that's guys... how the war started. And that's how the war measuring... started. The dick measuring competition. The dick measuring. Yeah. Yeah. So you guys are a little deeper into the mountains at this point. Um, so you guys are, are following them along for a while. Um, you start going further and further up into the mountains. And uh, you're, uh, you're changing altitude pretty rapidly. So you're, you're actually, you can actually tell um, like the air is getting a bit harder to breathe. Um, so everyone, give me a vigor check, and if you have anything that helps you with, like, altitude sickness, that would apply here. Because you're making a vigor check to not get altitude sickness. Alright. Draken, you're good. You can see if I have anything that helps. Right. I don't think, uh... <laughs> I can just control my blood. Is it? <laughs> If only I could manipulate my own blood. <laughs> oh no, Callus. <laughs> the old man ain't doing so good. <laughs> the old man body is not helping you out. Oh, I gotta give you guys Bennies also. Um, so let's see. Uh, Y'all got three, right? Nobody with luck? Yeah, correct. Alright. And then I get two more. It was uh, fine. Must be that peppy kid energy. <laughs> Uh, let's see. So yeah, if you got oh yeah, Shippo, <laughs> Shippo got a fucking fourteen. All right, so Draken, you're fine. Shippo, you're fine. Uh, Gallus, you're gonna take a point of fatigue. 
Um, just, you know, as you're getting that altitude sickness and that point of fatigue isn't going to go away till you get back to a normal altitude, unless you want to Benny that. I might Benny that, because that seems like something I don't want to carry. Right. I'm also <laughs> going to spend the Benny in case I have to make the preservation checks. Right. You'd be like, hey, we're here to talk to you guys about stuff. <laughs> about your car's extended warranty. <laughs> All right, so you're good with the nine. And that, yep, Gallus, you're good as well with the nine. All right, so you guys, yeah, you guys managed to, I think that's it. Everyone got the four or higher with the rerolls. Yes. So, yeah. All right. So, yeah, you guys you guys managed to to not get, you know, you keep it together. Um, and so, yeah, you follow the Agamids for a while. Um, and they lead you to a small camp nestled in a plateau cave kind of deal. Um, and here we go. You guys are down yonder. So yeah. Uh, find this nice little camp here. Um, there's a there's a bunch of Agamids standing guard. This sort of like makeshift fort it looks like. Um the Santa says no girls allowed. <laughs> Oh, uh, there's there's ladies. It's hard to tell, but they're there. You know, it's it's the beard because they're lizard women. <laughs> well, you guys just heading on in. Uh, cautiously. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I gotta try to take a peek to see if there's like weak points in the defenses or fe <laughs> you know and fences i head in but yeah um make a battle roll unskilled if you don't have that it's called a barrel roll <laughs> no <laughs> battle i just want to see if i see anything out of the ordinary and then i also yeah. want to do my spell casting to kind of detect how many of them are around okay um, no this is a five. that's a good roll dragon um Nope. Go. Yay for being unskilled, but rolling yeah. really well. Um. So yeah, with the five on the unskilled battle roll, um, you can tell that they've uh, they've got everything set up so that um, it's just tight quarters, um, which is really good for them against a like a larger force, um, right? Because it'll sort of just funnel everyone in, and they can pick pick people off like one by one as long as they're able to hold the choke points um yeah and then this this whole area is just like a pretty pretty makeshift fortification like they've taken like some lumber from lower parts of the mountains and brought it up here to get sort of a um was it like a palisade kind of setup um, this is probably, like, the weakest part where this gate is, just because it's this open area, and, like, the rest of it, it's all, like, natural cave systems that are tight quarters and everything. Um, you know, just fun stuff. Uh, Jamrel, is there anything in particular that you were looking for? Uh, kind of doing a generic sweep of, like, okay. that looks weird. Yeah. Um, looks like, you know, pretty standard, uh... Agamid fortification in the wilderness. Um, you know, nothing, nothing out of the ordinary from what you would expect, I guess. <laughs> um, but yeah, you guys like approach the gate here, and um... oh, that rock looks slightly different than that rock. <laughs> Don't make a note of that. <laughs> no, no, there's none of that. Um, but yeah, so the three dudes they lead you they lead you in. If you're still following them, they open the gate for you. Um, which you know is this thing right here. Um, and then yeah, these are the three that are leading you, and they're uh, they're like, 
like, come on. It's like, so we're going, gotta, gotta go talk to the chief. And, um, I also try to get a head count as I go through. Yeah. Um, you, you do like a quick sweep. Um, you're pretty sure there's somewhere around like 20 to 40 people here. Um, based on like what you can see, um, you can see a bunch of uh, <laughs> a bunch of supply crates stacked up over here. Um, it looks like there's a bunch of them uh, like doing worship. There's a shaman leading uh, leading a sort of religious ceremony of some kind. Um, and uh, <laughs> Do you recognize the icon or anything of the religion? Yeah, they're worshiping um, one of the uh, one of the primal elementals. Um, called uh, Strun, which is what they sort of take their name, their tribe's name of the the Vrugal Strun, which translates roughly to the Fighters of Strun. Gotcha. Um, and Strun is like a prime air elemental, which sort of fits with them all being um, the 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 Stormborn. Right. Cool. Um. Let's see. Oh yeah, and uh, Draken, give me a notice check. <laughs> All right. Well, I guess they're being really obvious, but like as you pass, you uh, you see one of the one of the agamids kind of like loudly like sniffs the air, like <laughs> and he's like and then he mumbles something about the the stink of the city. <laughs> uh, <Nice. laughs> but uh anyway so the three dudes they lead you down this this hallway up here um and eventually they bring you to this room where you see a rather important looking dude and his bodyguards oops sorry <laughs> I'm gonna be impotent. I might as well look impotent. <laughs> so you guys enter the room, and uh, the chief nods his head, and he's like, "Hello, travelers. I am Chief Rengor. What brings you to our domain?" <laughs> Don't all speak at once. <laughs> we all bow the face forward along with the person who can actually speak on the, the Right, the right. Yeah, so you oh, go yeah. forward with uh Yeah, Katya steps up there, I guess, with uh Moroku. Oh yeah, and you guys still got your two bandits with you. <laughs> yeah. So get everybody in there. Yeah, let me here, I'll, I'll drag you guys up. There you go. Oh, <laughs> That's two Morokus. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah. <laughs> um. Well, we brought you a gift. Um, some bandits that seem to be causing trouble in the area. Two of them are still around for you to deal with. It's like, hmm. Well, we appreciate that. You know, I can assure you we've, uh, we've been handling the situation, but, uh, but it's a nice gesture, nonetheless. <laughs> what exactly is the situation? Oh, you know. Territory disputes. The usual. But, um, but yeah, so Katya steps forward and she's just like, Listen, I, uh, I'm here on behalf of uh, Lady Naomi Rose of Castle Rose. Um, you've been, you and your people have uh, been attacking some of our trade caravans, and we'd like you to stop doing that. And the chief is just like, like he kind of like looks around at the room, and he's just sort of like, really? <laughs> really, like... Um, you, you think we're just gonna stop, or really? Yeah, like, yeah. Really like, really? 
<laughs> he's basically like, well, then you should protect him better. Like, <laughs> I'm sure there's some mutual agreement that can be struck. Yeah, do your thing, Both face guy. <laughs> <laughs> How did I? I was gonna say I'm not the face. Yeah, yeah I think that's technically me. Oh, <laughs> all right, Otterts is the. <laughs> <laughs> I thought Otterts and Maroki were like the charismatic based characters here. Yeah. Um, so yeah, I guess uh, I'll just echo that sentiment. Surely there's some sort of agreement that can be made. I'm just like, gonna roll persuasion because I yeah. can't think of what to say. Oh. <laughs> Hello. I didn't go very well. Oh no. I'm gonna Benny that. Okay. Surely there's enough fish for everyone. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, uh, loses something in translation. <laughs> so he sees this, uh, you know, sees this little otter otter man step out, right? And he just yeah. kind of looks at you and blinks. Fucking <laughs> <laughs> <Locking> appetizer? <laughs> um, he's like, I mean, what what do you have to offer? Like, what what could you give us to have us stop attacking you? Well, people <laughs> mentioned that there are territory disputes. <laughs> you say the situation is in hand, and yet on our way in your territory, uh, we were assaulted by bandits. It's like, yeah, and my people were on their way to deal with them. Hmm. Oh, two of them? Yeah. Uh, Katya kind of speaks up again. He's like, I've been authorized to open up trade relations with you and your people. If that is something you'd be interested in. And he kind of like, the chief kind of glares back at her and he's like, yes, yes, trade with you city folk always ends well. We haven't been pushed out of the West or anything like that. Not really a city so much as a mud hole. <laughs> <laughs> well, you guys you guys know when he mentions they've been pushed out of the West that he's he's talking about Northwatch. <laughs> Is that the one we're trying to overthrow or the one run by <laughs> Dave's descendant? Yeah. That's not a mutually exclusive question. No, no. <laughs> that is fair. E or is East that a yes? East Haven is the one on your, like, shit list uh, immediately. But, you know, Nor Northwatch is the old, uh, you know, your old, <laughs> your previous character's yeah. stomping grounds. Is that, like, the capital of that kingdom now, or is it still wherever? No, they're doing, a, they're doing a whole succession war thing, but yeah, no right. Northwatch is occupying the capital. <laughs> Fair enough. Um, well, the child certainly wouldn't be hurt. <laughs> <laughs> but Otter, it's you, you kind of like are trying to steer things to be more amenable. And, you know, with that, that persuasion role there. Um, yeah. And the chief's just kind of thinking. He's like, you know, we can't just be making deals with city folk all willy nilly. But, I suppose if a few of you felt like going through our initiation tomorrow, perhaps we could, we could deal as equals. Sure. I'll do it. <laughs> okay. You, you kind of hear, like, some mumbling from the warriors, but he, uh, the shaman, like, smacks his staff into the ground and everybody kind of shuts up. Um, he's like, excellent, excellent. We have, a, we have a bunch of young bloods that will be becoming men tomorrow. Perhaps a few of you will be strong enough to join them. <laughs> um, but yeah, he's, 
basically inviting you guys to do their like coming of age rites. <laughs> okay. So that you know you could be seen Emerald as as kind equals. Kind of pokes Dracon and is like, what does that involve? <laughs> yeah. Uh, team, you you guys can all like make. Yeah, you guys can all make common knowledge rolls. Draken, you'd have a bonus on this, I guess. A plus, a plus two, because it's kind of your whole thing. Uh. <laughs> all right. I've heard about this. Yep. Yep. Apparently, a bunch of you have. <laughs> all right. Um. So yeah, you guys know that there's um. For the for this particular tribe, there uh, there's there's three parts to their their typical rite of passage. Um, the mating dance is part of it. <laughs> no, no, no. the The first one is uh, you go on like a basically a ten mile road march through the mountains, which doesn't sound so bad, um, but you have to do it with a mouthful of water, and not swallow your water. What um, about breathing? It? Is that okay? <laughs> <laughs> Basically, you have to take a mouth. They give you like a, you know, you you take a mouthful of water. You march the ten miles without, you know, swallowing it or anything, and then you spit it out at the end. And like, you have to have like a certain amount that you spit out in order to pass. <laughs> um, so it's just it sort of. Try anyone with a head smaller than yeah, than yeah, a dragon. Or yeah. <laughs> Suckers. I mean, it's it's proportional to your your anatomy, so you know. Um, but yeah, so that's just sort of like a test of like endur of endurance and willpower. And then um, the other thing is you you are ha you have to wrestle uh, a bundle of grass from a boar, um, and then it ends with a great hunt where you're all sent after a dire boar. And that's more of a just survive sort of thing. <laughs> I thought it was a get dinner thing. Uh, yeah, <laughs> that, those aren't exclusive, you know. <laughs> um, so it's, you know, kind of tough, but doable, you know. <laughs> mostly, mostly doable. Hmm. Um, Gallus is kind of vacillating between wanting to show, try to show up the the younger ones, <laughs> and also kind of a I don't really feel like going through all of this again. <laughs> I don't feel like you know breaking, messing up my infantry knees even more. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> oh boy, the circle, the start off circle jerk again. <laughs> Um, but yeah, basically, you know, you guys, and if, you know, if, if, if at least one of you makes it through this, like, we'll, we'll talk, we'll talk about trade deals. Um, and you guys are just sort of, uh, he kind of like, after you have your talk, he dismisses you guys and, you know, they, a bunch of the other warriors are just like, yeah, you know, you guys can you know, crash wherever, we'll, everything will, will start in the early in the morning, um, so, you know, get some sleep and whatnot. Sounds good. All yeah, righty. Find any, find any, uh, cold, hard rock on the floor. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's like, well, they're lizard people, they're used to sleeping on rocks. <laughs> Actually, see a bunch of them all get in a pile for warmth. <laughs> yeah, yeah, for warmth. <laughs> for warmth. Yeah, absolutely. All right. So, are you guys doing anything in particular before you bed down for the night? Um, I guess I kind of just like wander, want to wander around a bit. Like, is there, like, trade goods around or anything like that? Or uh, there's the, like the ones, there's the pile of stolen trade goods. <laughs> All right, yeah, yeah, Over yeah. here. 
they weren't, so they weren't being framed by the bandits. No. <laughs> yeah, they, they were literally just stealing shit. <laughs> um, and when you guys come out, like you don't see the two bandits. There's like no sign of them. <laughs> There's a, but there's a lovely tartar buffet out there. <laughs> yeah, they rare is better. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus. Um. But yeah, so if you guys just kind of explore around, there's like you know this this area up here is kind of a um, just sort of like a bunk area. Um. What's the ventilation like? I mean, it's a cave, so. <laughs> it, yeah, but it's usually some sort of cross breeze or, yeah. you know, like for for a lot for like sarin gas or uh, mustard gas or something like that. Oh, uh, not really. <laughs> um, yeah, and then then over here, there's sort of like an altar set up where they do worship and stuff, and then there's like some more sort of tents and things set up. Um, yeah, it's pretty it's pretty bare bones. Um, but yeah, so you guys pretty much just find a spot on the floor to <laughs> throw your bed rolls down or whatever, and yeah, comfy. Yeah. You guys doing watch or anything, or <laughs> probably not a terrible idea. Yeah, not a bad yeah. Idea. I'm not opposed to it. <laughs> if for no other reason than just not to get any stuff stolen, right? Right. Or just eat pranked or fucked with. Yeah. Yeah. The night before a a big thing happening. Yeah. Yeah. Or like if they all just decide to peace out. <laughs> you wake up in the morning like, where the fuck are they? Fuck those idiots. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Yeah, so who's who's doing watch? I can take first watch. I'll take second. I'm happy to take one of them. Does anybody have a notice higher than six? Was better at? No, I also have a six. <laughs> six. So should we do pairs? Because there's six of us, I think. Probably, right? Yeah, that makes sense. Yeah, including the uh, guard captain. All right, so I guess I'll do third. Um, I don't know. Me and Dave are our, our third? Sure. All right. Uh, give me a minute. I need to look a thing up. Why is this now? Actually, there's seven of us. Yeah. Uh, oh yeah, here we go. So, I'm going to do an interlude as part of this, too. Because, you know, you guys are camping out or whatever um so who is taking the first watch gallus gallus oh you, were you guys doing pairs or yeah we should i can go i can double up on first i can i can do both uh i can do yeah. both shifts for the uh for a second oh you and ship <laughs> yeah morocco and ship can Okay. Yeah, and then Dave and or yeah. Yeah, and then Caddy can cover one. <laughs> Nobody trusts her. Like I'm the survivalist. So <laughs> <laughs> Trevor. <laughs> Jesus. Ah, uh, yeah. I gotta give her her bennies back. All right. All right. So who's got the first watch again? Gallus. Gallus and, and Draken. And Draken. Okay. So you guys uh, give me notice checks. Yeah. 
Uh, you guys keep watch and nobody does any foolish things. Um, and let's see. I'm gonna do interludes for this as well, so you guys can chit chat. Um, if you're cool with that. Oh, whoops. What does uh, interlude mean? Uh, so I'll go over that in a second. I just gotta get this lady to stop screaming in my ear. <laughs> yeah, pretty epic uh, background music for we all took a nap. Yeah. <laughs> I all. Hey, right, there we go. Alright, so here, I'll I just... I used to follow sleep to typo negative. Here, I'm just gonna move you guys down here, because it's probably where you're camped out. <laughs> Alright. Uh, so, yeah. So, um, an interlude is sort of a, um... Like a, like a just a in-character in character. roleplay thing. Um, basically, I draw a card to give you like a prompt, um, and you guys are just sort of doing your downtime. So, um, and it's based off of the the card suit. Uh, so I drew a heart. So, uh, Gallus and uh, Draken, you guys are doing hearts. Um, Um, so you guys are kind of practicing a skill while you're on watch. So what are what are your skills that you're you're kind of working on? I mean, I'm probably prepping. You know, honestly, either fighting or stealth. <laughs> I'm just getting ready to you know get dinner for tomorrow night. <laughs> Sharpening your your spear and everything. Yeah. Yeah. What about you, Gallus? Uh, skills in term of term in the game term, or skills in a general term? Uh either. You know, it could be you could be like woodworking or some shit. You know, <laughs> carving a fucking a wooden banana or so. I don't know. <laughs> uh, probably more likely making sure gear is in good order and. Yeah. Stretching. <laughs> Good call. <laughs> All right. So yeah, you guys, your shift goes off without any issues. Um, you know, you practice your skills there, get your shit ready. Um, who had the next shift? Moroku and Shippo. Moroku and Shippo. All right. So, what am I gonna draw for you guys? You guys got a club. Uh, clubs. <laughs> Your hero oh, yeah. broods or is angry about something. What is it and how does she misbehave? <laughs> <laughs> so I guess that's more for Moroku. You're kind of brooding <laughs> right now. For reasons. Uh, he's upset that the, uh, the, that the guard captain hasn't complimented him on it. On on his uh, fine physique. Yeah, especially <laughs> for a monk. <laughs> she, you're mad You're mad. she won't notice you, senpai? Yeah. <laughs> Excellent. Oh my god! <laughs> you see everything. <laughs> did you eat the spice? I think I did. <laughs> I can see the universe. <laughs> <laughs> um, what did Shippo get? Not that you need to make any notice roll ever, but I kind of want to see how much how how good he is at guard duty. <laughs> he is all the goodness for those D four. Oh no! Oh no! He's paying attention. <laughs> All right, yeah. So your your shift goes off without any issues. Yeah. <laughs> um, and then I guess Jamril and Otterts had the third shift, right? Mm-hmm. All, right. All right. So what do I got for you guys? Uh, so diamonds. Uh, oh, the character studies or works on an object of some sort. What is it? <laughs> mm. So like a craft? Yeah. Or, you know, anything, really. 
<laughs> Otterts is building a ship in a bottle. <laughs> you just have that with you in your bag. <laughs> Outstanding. He misses a ship. Yeah. <laughs> I'm trying to see what I got for skills and what was his some of his background things. Uh, do, 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 do. I don't need vehicles. I got a really long backstory. I don't think he has any fucking interests. He's a sad kid. Um, <laughs> He's a sad emo kid. Kind of whittling What's something, it? so maybe like a smoking pipe or something. Nice. Enjoy that that hobbit weed. Mm -hmm. Alright. And then yeah, both of you guys give me a notice check. I already did. Oh. Oh god. Okay. <laughs> He's got this. Yeah, Gemeral, you're kinda just sorta distracted with the the pipe and everything. <laughs> um but yeah, Otterts, you don't see anything any shenanigans. Um cool. you know, you guys finish your shift and uh Katya takes the last two hours. Um, I don't know. To do her makeup? No. Yeah, to do her makeup. No. <laughs> um, oh, jeez. What does a joker mean? <laughs> oh. Too bad that We're wasn't one of you guys. Right? No, no. <laughs> the free advancement. <laughs> no, no. That, so it wasn't a... Yeah, that's only... If one of you guys drew it, you'd get an extra Benny and choose the category, but um yeah, I guess like, you know, she takes watch and I guess you guys, as you're going to sleep, you kind of see her uh, writing in a, in a journal. Um, and, you know, some of the other guys might happen to notice that while you're Tossing and turning on your nice, comfortable rock surface. Uh, but yeah, y'all get a Benny for doing the thing. Yay! Yay. Woo! Um, oh yeah, and I gotta, I'm gotta, i going to drop one off of me. So I just gave one to everyone because it was easiest. Um, but yeah, so you guys, um, you know, there are no shenanigans throughout the night. Um, you guys wake up early in the morning as a bunch of the... Uh, the youngins are getting rounded up. They're all grabbing their gear and whatnot for the uh, for the trip. Um, and you actually see a few of them set out, uh, like as you guys are are packing up all your shit. Um, and basically, like one of the shaman has like this big uh, this big wooden bowl full of the water, and they like take it and they sip it, and it's sort of like this little ceremony type of thing as they're taking in the water and stuff. Um, you know, and you see a bunch of them go out uh, before your turns come up. Um, and so you guys sort of just do what you've seen them doing. You, you know, you take the bowl, you take as much water as you can in your mouth and try not to swallow. And uh, yeah, y'all head out on this 10 mile hike through the mountains. I'm going to move you guys on the Yurld map here. Oh, how did we get all the way down here? Uh, you guys are up in the, them mountains. Anyway. So. For this, I'm um, going to need a couple things. Uh, first, a vigor roll to see, you know, if you get through it without... Like murdering your body, I guess. <laughs> uh, so everyone, give me a vigor roll. Uh, Drake, and you're good. Jamrel, you're good. Jamrel, you're just like super into this today for some reason. Uh, Moroku. <laughs> Talk to Janae, motherfucker. Moroku, you're good. Uh, Gallus and Otterts are just hating life right now. <laughs> Um, unless you guys want to, um, Otterts, you got like an encumbrance penalty, it looks like. I don't know if... Yeah, I don't know what that's from. Uh, probably your gear weight. Oh. Um. Uh, 
Doesn't seem like it should be, right? Yeah. Um, so you, you actually got a four without that penalty, so I don't... Okay. So I think you're okay, but yeah, Gal... <laughs> so, everyone so everyone except Gallus is okay. Gallus is just like, oh my god, fuck this. <laughs> I might penny that. Yeah. My, yeah, it might be worth it. Uh, cause you, yeah, you're gonna, okay. Yeah, so you make it with the four. Um... <laughs> So Gallus, you're like you're like hating life, but you pretty much power through it like out of pure spite. Um, so you guys won't take any fatigue from it. Uh, now I also need a uh, oh yeah, I should roll for uh, for Katya too to see how she does. <laughs> Cause why not, right? Uh, where's she at though? There we go. Got to see how the NPCs do, right? Uh, vigor. There it is. Okay. I think Sorry, she I might had... have some bonuses to this. Oh, no. I had some armor that wasn't actually there that I removed. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, she's just, like, been there, done that. <laughs> um, yeah, so next roll I need from you guys is survival, because you're still trying to navigate through the woods. Or, well, through the mountains. Um... Yep, Draken, you're fine. <laughs> Gallus, you're just like on point, leading. Jamrel, you have no fucking idea where where you are right now. Um, you guys like this will be kind of a group thing. If most of you guys get it, it'll be fine. Wait, why um, is it drinking again? I just got rid of. Oh, unskill, actually. Yeah. Okay. Cool. All right. <laughs> Jesus. Um, and then. I'll roll for Katya. Where the fuck? Survival. There we go. I know she has fucking survival. There we go. <laughs> um, so let's see. Well, a bunch of you guys got raises on it, so I think that'll cover for you guys who didn't make it. Yeah. So you guys are fine. You stay on the path. Um, and then the last bit is I need a spirit check from everyone, and this is to not swallow the water. Oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> Moroku, you're just like I can never <laughs> swallow. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. Yeah, you guys are just like Which <laughs> on this before? I think all of you got a raise on this. Holy shit. Gallus didn't. <laughs> oh. <laughs> but I feel like you can cut him some slack. Yeah, yeah. Um and then keeps running up this mountain. And Katya does all right, yeah. So yeah, you guys, you know, you guys make it to the end of the road march. Um, you know, you you find the uh, the site of the next challenge, um, and there's a uh, there's a bunch of shamans uh, waiting there. Um, and you see uh, you see a couple of the other agamids ahead of you. They they spit out the water into a bowl and they sort of put it on a. Um, uh, God, what the hell? Um, like a, they have like yeah. they have a like yeah like a makeshift scale, and um, basically it's sort of like they have they have like a rock on one end and then they put the water and the bowl on the other end and as long as it like lifts up the rock enough they're like okay yeah you pass, so like even if you didn't get all the water you just had to get enough of the water, um, but yeah you guys like pass this with flying colors and the the shamans actually seem kind of impressed. <laughs> um, and then they uh, they thusly flat used... skins did well. <laughs> What's that? The flat skins did the well. The flat skins. <laughs> Jesus. Oh my god! I have to use that now. The flat skins <laughs> and the furry one <laughs> and, the, and the city dweller. Um. <laughs> But yeah, so you guys are next. You are brought into this sort of uh, arena in a cave. Um, so let's, yeah. So you guys can kind of drag yourselves. I don't have you guys on the map here, but you know you have this arena. Um, the boar is up here, like munching on this big pile of grass. Um, and essentially, what you guys have to do is you have to get the grass away from the boar, and then you have to, like, 
basically run away from the boar. The only rule here is you can't hurt or kill the boar. Like, damn it. <laughs> yeah. I got this. What's that? <laughs> Do we have to do it one by one, or can we do it as a group? It's 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 meant to be one by one. It's like a it's okay. like a skill check thing. It's not yeah, gonna really? be like straight combat. It's um, or yeah. Sorry, I was gonna run it as a dramatic task. Okay. Um. So you like you'll you'll kind of have some options as to what skills you want to use if it makes sense, you know. Um. But you'll basically we'll run it on initiative, but it'll be three rounds, and you'll have to get four success tokens in three rounds to survive this. No, I'm so glad I took Beast, beast yeah. Friend. <laughs> <laughs> I'm oh, glad yeah. I have Fleet Footed. Oh, yeah. Uh, <laughs> well, it's mostly skill checks, so it's not like going off of like pace and stuff. Uh, but could, could we use like um, like powers and stuff? Um, <laughs> It's kind of against the spirit of it, but... <laughs> If oh, you're wait, subtle really? about it, yeah. Oh, yeah, I wasn't yeah. planning on being subtle about it. Yeah, like, you guys <laughs> you guys <laughs> see uh, you guys see a few Agamids go ahead of you. Um, like, you know, they're going in one by one, and, you know, you see this one guy, like, just straight up runs up to the boar and, like, tries to spook it and, like, grab the grass, and the, he's, like, the boar's, like, chasing him in circles around the arena. He's, like, hopping over the rocks and stuff and just... They're doing that thing where, like, the rock's in between him, and he's, like, trying to go this way, and then the boar tries to go this way, but then he tries to go the other way, and then the boar goes the other way, and they kind of go back and forth. And then, you know, after about, like, a minute of this tomfoolery, one of the the shamans, like, calls it and is like, hey, you passed. Um, you see this other guy, like, try to sneak up on the boar, and the boar just, like, flips out and, like, gores the shit out of him with his tusks. <laughs> and they like send a few people in there to like drag him out of the arena <laughs> you know Radio so the board doesn't like com completely fucking maul him to death um and then yeah you guys come up so who wants to go first yeah. I'll go first <laughs> Draken's just like I'll do it alright so you uh I'm going to eat the boar <laughs> <laughs> All right, so let me get you on the initiative. I set um, the grass on fire because it, it said I just have to get it away from the boar. He doesn't have okay, it anymore. There we go. <laughs> um, deal, new round. All right, so you have a queen of hearts. Um, so I think there's no uh, no modifiers on a heart. So, um, yeah, how are you going to approach this? You have this boar. He's munching on a pile of grass, and you have to steal the pile of grass. Well, that is the question. <laughs> I mean, are you going to try to be sneaky? Are you just going to, like, run up to him and grab it? I think I'm going to go with the run up and grab it, because that would be athletics versus stealth. I'm yeah, yeah. Better. So, um, yeah, just make an athletics check. <laughs> Nice. All right. So the 10, that is a, yeah, that is a raise. So that'll give you two success tokens. I'm just going to do a green dot on you. Um, so you need four to succeed. So yeah, you run up and you, you grab the, you, you just like run up, swoop it right out from under him. And you know, it squeals and starts chasing you around and stuff. Um, so yeah, you got this pissed off boar coming after you. What are you doing now? <laughs> I'm very quickly moving away from it. All right. Make another athletics check. Oh, I was supposed to deal... Hold on, let me deal you a new a new thing. Sorry. Uh, okay, yeah, so you're good. So that's a six. That is a success. So the boar is chasing you around the arena, and, you know, all these all these other agamids are, like, cheering you on and stuff. Because <laughs> you're, you're putting on this, this pretty fun show. Uh... <laughs> But yeah, you're still I'm getting chased. Entertain. What's that? I'm here to entertain, apparently. Yeah. yeah. Um, <laughs> you're not entertained. So yeah, you yeah, you know, this you're running you're running around the arena in circles and the boar is chasing you. He wants his food back. Um so and now we're on round three. So what are you doing for this last round? 
I think I'm just going to keep running. Just keep running. Just like, just do what works. Let's see if I can wear it out. I have, I can, I can move fast. I have good endurance. Yeah, I'm going to yeah. see if I can run it out. All right. Oh, no. <laughs> and uh, I'm a Benny Bat. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. All right. Yeah, so that's enough me. to get your success, um, your fourth success. Um, so, yeah, you managed to, to outrun the boar long enough and... And, you know, one of the shaman calls it. It seems like they let it go a little longer than the last guy, but, you know, you're still successful. <laughs> um, so, yeah, congratulations. <laughs> you you, you outwitted okay. the board. Pressure's off. <laughs> yeah. Uh, who wants to go next? I'll do it. <laughs> oh, my God, that hurts. <laughs> So, <laughs> so Otter, it's like jumps in the the arena. Yeah. So I don't know. What I wanted originally to do was just telekinesis the boar and like lift it up and go <laughs> take the grass. <laughs> I mean, one of you already won, so you guys can kind of fuck around a little more if you want. <laughs> uh, uh, also, where are you? I'm trying to drag you onto the map here, and I don't. Oh, there we go. So yeah, there we go. Um, okay, cool. So got no. you on the. <laughs> but I guess if I have to be subtle about it too, I can probably just uh, like keep it pinned with the. Token. Well, you are um, you are a sorcerer, right? So you yeah, like yeah. you don't have any like somatic or verbal components you need to do. Yeah, pretty much. Um, oh yeah, and I need to clear the turn and add you. Because uh, it, it if you get a club, you get negatives on your rolls, so. Um, Got it. And I think jokers can give you a bonus or something. That's been all. Um, yeah, I'll we'll cross that bridge if we get to it. Um, okay. Yeah, five. Jokers and always give you a bonus. Yeah. Oh right, right. Yeah, you get the yeah if you you get the bonus from a joker. Uh, yeah. Hold on. I should probably get the rules up for this, so I'm not running it entirely out of memory, huh? Dramatic task. All right. Yeah, I think the only. Yeah, so the only time you get a negative is if it's a um, uh, a club. Okay. I'm pretty sure. Oh, yeah, here we go. Dramatic test, yeah. <coughs> yeah, it's called a complication. So you get like a minus two on it if you get a club, which is a complication. Okay. Um, did, but did yeah. You, uh, but you yeah, you got, a, you got a five of diamonds, so you're rolling oh. whatever normally. Um, I see it. Cool. Yeah. All right. So I'm gonna just roll to activate telekinesis. <laughs> yeah. So roll your yeah. Roll your um. Occult. Yeah. Uh. No. Your focus. Uh. Focus. Yeah. That's yeah. your <laughs> skill for activating powers. I thought it was occult. For no. Uh, occult is basically knowing. like your arcana skill. Um. Huh. You okay. should have a focus skill. Yeah, I think my focus skill is a cult, isn't it? No, oh, you're... Uh. <laughs> okay. you're... You have a skill called focus, or you should have one. <laughs> okay. No, I've been using a cult as my... Uh, oh, yeah. No, you're supposed to use focus, so you might want to rebuild that, right. but we can use that for now. Um, but right. yeah, you're Who's supposed to use the focus skill, which goes off of your spirit. Oh, I see it now. Yeah. Okay, so actually, it, I'll just... <laughs> Change but that. that eleven is fine. Is fine. You are now okay. levitating a fucking boar <laughs> subtly. So like, yep. this boar just starts floating up, and everybody's like, "What the fuck?" <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah. So the boar is floating. Um, <laughs> what are you doing now? Oh shit, that's a club. So you have a minus two on whatever you're doing next. I'm um, just going to pick up the grass. <laughs> so you just go to pick up the grass. Um, Where's lava? <laughs> so you're a small guy, and the grass is like a pretty good-sized bundle. So just make an athletics check to pick that up, but you're going to be at minus two. Okay. Is my neck go up? Oh. Oh, did you add the minus two? <laughs> uh, no, I didn't. So All right. Yeah, so yeah, two. that's a fail, unless you want to Benny it. Uh, I mean, the boar is still floating, right? The boar is floating. He may not be if you fail this. <laughs> well, but... Oh, is that a different roll? 
Uh, well, it, I'm sort of like, this is sort of like macro level, the way these tasks yeah, yeah. work. Oh, Benny. Okay. Also, <laughs> minus two, sorry. So, yeah, that's still a fail. All right. So, um, you, you're going to, like, grab the thing and, like, your TK just kind of wears off or you lose concentration or something. And the boar just, like, plops down and lands right in front of you. And it is not happy that you just, you know, lifted it into the air. And it, like, snarls at you and you see it, like, scratching its hoofs against the ground ready to charge at you. Um, <laughs> so, <laughs> round three. Would, oh, God, you got another claw. <laughs> oh, jeez. Um, uh, you can also use Benny's to redraw your initiative if you want. Mm, so you don't have the club. <laughs> sure. All right. Uh, yeah, why not? All right. So you got a you got a two of spades instead. So no no penalty. Okay. Good. <laughs> I think that I will uh, panic. <laughs> Just <laughs> uh, telekinesis that again. Oh, oh no! <laughs> right, we'll ready that too. All right, Can yeah. Use your dumb luck. Oh. <laughs> All right, there you go. So you're just like, <laughs> uh, you accidentally launch it into orbit. <laughs> right? Remember, yeah, you you're like trying not to kill it. <laughs> <laughs> so you, yeah, you end up like launching the boar out of the arena and like it squeals as it flies through the air and lands and it just starts like running around the arena and all the agavids are like oh fuck and they're trying to grab it or whatever um but yeah Catch you me. you technically pass <laughs> the best kind of pass <laughs> um yeah and so yeah, it takes about it takes some um, like 20 minutes or so to round up the boar and get him back into the arena, munching on his sweet grass and for whoever <laughs> wants to go next. <laughs> so oh, Gerald. bro, just gotta make sure I can get off round eight. Oh, so. yeah, yeah. All right. Um, so, yeah, let what me you said? get you. <laughs> Don't be gross, Tammy. <laughs> All right. Deal in it. All right, so you got a three yards. So the boar is <laughs> back to munching on the grass, and you're you're there in the arena. How okay. are you tackling this? I'm gonna do some uh, faux uh, Jurassic Park like animal wrangling <laughs> arm movements to disguise I'm casting puppet. Oh, nice. <laughs> All right. Yeah, so you're sort of like puppeting the boar quietly yeah and it's nothing like none of the commands are like you know extravagant it's more of just like <laughs> heal and then like chase me but not very fast <laughs> hmm. chase me big chili goose <laughs> alright yeah so you managed like to I tamed it and then like getting the grass and then have it just like follow me around <laughs> All right. <laughs> uh, <laughs> let me deal you a new round. Um, okay. So, yeah, do another um, spell casting roll there. No, I was going to re-roll because that would be the easiest. Yeah, yeah. I still get a plus two because of my ability. <laughs> oh, my God. Yeah, so you just, like, got this nailed down. Uh, <laughs> this, you know, this bar's, like, following you around, eating out of your hand, and everybody's like, what the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> you had a rough day. <laughs> well, you did just get launched through the air. <laughs> yeah, so you're like, bump, done, like, <laughs> easy peasy. Um, yeah, so you're, you pass. Um, who wants to go next? I uh, guess Shippo. <laughs> oh, God. Yeah, get in there, Shippo. You can do it. <laughs> I'm going to use performance and pre and pretend that I'm a... Uh, that I am also a boar. Look at me! I'm a boar! <laughs> We're friends. 
<laughs> All right. <laughs> Oddly enough, it seems to be working at least somewhat. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> and, then, and then I'm gonna acrobat. I'm gonna acrobat away with it. Okay. Um. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus. Um. I'll do that. Okay. Ah, uh, yeah. So that's. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, excuse me. And then I'm going to attempt to confuse it with, um, <laughs> by doing, uh, three card Monty. <laughs> you just pull out a deck of cards? <laughs> what? Yes, the bar is sufficiently confused and just, like, watches you do that instead of chases you around. <laughs> <laughs> Um, so yeah, that's four, and you are successful. <laughs> so weird. Um, alright. Who else would like to go? I guess Gals might give it a try. <laughs> but I guess game mechanics question of, can I actually use taunt on it? Yeah. Okay. Then we're going to see how this goes. <laughs> All right. Because I think I'm basically just going to try and stare it down and just, like, force it to back off. Yeah. Okay. Intimidate. Yeah. <laughs> Tomato, potato. The way Taunt was kind of worded for outside of combat, it sounded like it can do some of the similar things. Interesting yeah. Little. Yeah. Too bad you can't, like, do networking with Taunt. Like, you just... <laughs> people up enough that they tell you like, when you want to know. Hey, yo, bitch! Tell me your secrets! <laughs> Alright, so you're going to try to taunt the boar? <laughs> yes. Alright. Roll taunt. Oh, no. <laughs> I blame the lag on the bad roll. <laughs> Are you going to Benny that, or... Yeah. All right. Oh, just shy of the raise, but that's one success. Yeah. So. Oh, actually, I may not have had to be uh, Benny it. I get a free reroll on taunt tests. Oh, okay. All right, so I'll give you your Benny back. <laughs> I want my Benny back, Benny back, Benny back, Benny back. <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> all right. So round two. Uh, all right. Diamonds. So, you know, the boar has, has its attention on you. You have taunted the boar. <laughs> uh, don't worry about measurement or anything. This is kind of just okay. sort of macro level skill use. I just set up the map for the visuals. <coughs> cool, cool. Um, yeah, let's try it again. See if I can force him to back down. Suey, suey. <laughs> yeah, it's at least not a fail. Yeah. So. Alright. So <laughs> you're like, you're taunting the, the pig. Um, you got one round left, so. Um. Let's see. New round. Oh, shit. And it's a club. So you're going to have a minus two on this. The, yeah. It, it might it might be getting mad, actually mad at you at this point. <laughs> I'm kind of tempted to Benny it, but I kind of want to see how that goes. <laughs> All right. Yeah, we'll just roll with it. Makes sense. All yeah. right. And I already included the negative, so okay. five. All right, so that is enough to succeed, but you needed uh, you needed four and three rounds to sort of get this. So I guess what happens is you like are staring this thing down, and you go to grab the thing, and it just like flips out and kind of <laughs> just like headbutts you. Um. Awesome. <laughs> yeah, it chases you around for a bit, but like. 
they end up having a like distract the thing and and pull you out of there so it doesn't like stomp the shit out of you uh, so unfortunately you do not pass but you know a for effort yeah i survived <laughs> it's like whatever back in my day it was a dire bore <laughs> <laughs> Hey, I managed to get it to back down for a little while, just staring it down. Yeah. <laughs> All right, who wants to go next? I think I it's only Morocco's left. Yeah. <coughs> and I'll run Katya through it if you guys want to see her do woodland stuff. <laughs> yeah, like um, like she set, uh, sets a uh, a bear kill trap. <laughs> It's like a fucking rock. Come get it, you! Ah, <laughs> uh, so Moroku, you're doing your thing. Uh, new round. Alright, no complications. Uh, so how are you tackling this? Uh, it's gonna kind of like monologue at it, I guess. Trying to use <laughs> persuasion to uh, convince it. Spend that Benny. <laughs> Shake that bear. Oh my god. Alright. <laughs> <laughs> Somehow the bar is like watching you monologue at it. <laughs> see so you see, like you sh we need to redistribute <laughs> the wealth among those who are in need versus those who are in want. And you are in want. And I am in of need. Just and kinda I like <laughs> at you. <laughs> I'm going to use battle to distract it by saying, "Over there, look! Someone's trying to trying to take your cookie." <laughs> <laughs> Somehow that works. <laughs> and I will uh, run my kill. All right, so you grab it and go. Oh yeah, there you go. <laughs> yeah. The better part of valor is bravely repositioning yourself somewhere yeah. else. All right, so that is a success. <laughs> the boar is confused for long enough to that you don't really have to run around too much. Um, <laughs> but yeah, I guess I'll, I'll have uh, I'll have the captain go as well, so she can show off. <laughs> so she hops in, and uh. She starts doing, like, weird Jurassic... She's, like, doing the actual Jurassic Park shit. <laughs> <laughs> um, oh, she got a club shit. The boar might be ornery. It's been getting fucked with all morning, so maybe it's... You know. It's not having I mean, a, a great airborne, day. So, yeah. Yeah, <laughs> it did go airborne at one point. Um, <laughs> so, yeah, she's going to try to use her survival to sort of... You know, comet or whatever. Well, not terribly. <laughs> oh, she's gonna fuck this up, isn't she? <laughs> <laughs> All right, so she's like carefully approaching, and you know, calms it, and I guess she's now like trying to be sneaky. She's gonna gonna like use stealth to try to get up on it, and. And snatch the stuff away. So. Huzzah. Uh, Alright. <laughs> so she manages that. Uh, and then for the last round. She got another club. <laughs> I'm going to have her spend one of her bennies. To not have a club. Sorry she got killed. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. And then she's just going to fucking run. Which is not a great skill she has. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> yeah, so you guys see her. Yeah, you know what? I'll, I'll use her other Benny for this. It's like the end of the night, almost. <laughs> um, let me roll that. And she did worse. All right. So you see her kind of running around for a bit. And the boar, like, manages to catch her. And she, like, drops the bundle. And 
Yeah, like she, yeah, she, it like catches up with her, and she basically dumps the bundle and just sort of climbs out. Um, like she doesn't get fucked up or anything, but she didn't last long enough, so it's not yeah. not a pass. <laughs> she seems kind of angry about it, <laughs> but uh, but yeah, so that's that. Uh, you guys watch a few others go through, and you know some of them pass, some of them don't. Um. Are you like are you talking shit trying to cause some of them to fuck up since they've been <laughs> grumbling at you the whole time? Who? Uh, the other Agamid. Oh, Draken. <laughs> yeah. Nah, I just kind of watch an amusement as they struggle. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Yeah. So you guys, you You're guys watch it somewhere. You guys watch this go on for like a few more hours. Um, by the time it's all is said and done, it's like late morning, afternoonish. Um, you know, and they they put the boar like back into the the boar prison or whatever. <laughs> um, and then you see a bunch of shaman bring out uh, this fucking dire boar. <laughs> Did we already fight the dire boar? <laughs> oh, no, that's a dire bear. I need a dire boar. There we go. Not as big as a dire bear, but still pretty large. This is um, my dire, dire owl bear, because I'm just going to combine all the templates. Yeah, so, so a bunch of the shamans, they bring out this dire boar, um... And they kind of start like painting it with all these um, all these different decorations and symbols and whatnot. Like it's clearly some sort of ritual thing. Um, but it looks like this is the thing you are you guys are going to go hunt. Uh, and they are just painting it up as a way to to mark it as your your quarry, I guess. Um, you know, they do the thing. <laughs> Wear dire owl bear. <laughs> <laughs> oh god, I hope not. Um And bear pig. <laughs> no, half man, half bear pig. No, it's half man bear, half pig. <laughs> um But yeah, so they paint up this dire boar, um and then they turn it loose into the mountains. And uh the shamans are all like, Alright Go catch it. Seems that like is you your quarry. Easy to catch it if, if, it, if you didn't let go of it. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, well, yes, that's the that's the idea. Um, so, like a bunch of the bunch of the agamids all kind of rush outside. Um, you guys follow them, and uh, you see it run off into the mountains. Um, so, this will require some survival checks to track it down. Um, Goodbye, boar. Be free. <laughs> it's like, no, let it go. <laughs> no, that's dinner. Yeah. It is. <laughs> I'm just not helping you on the survival front. Oh. <laughs> uh, yeah, Drake, and that's pretty much you, and, and Katya can, can assist. I cannot. <laughs> All right. Well, I mean, you could try, <laughs> even if you're unskilled. Um, so let's see. She's going to give you a, she'll give you a plus one on that. Um, but yeah, with the, with the six, yeah, you're able to, you're able to, you know, it was, the boar kind of ran off in a hurry. It wasn't being sneaky or anything. So it's pretty easy to, to pick up its trail. Um, and with, yeah, with the six, um, this will put you guys on the chase screen here. Um. So yeah, you guys can see the boar. Uh, you can see there's some other other agamid. These are like groups of agamids here. Um, and I'm gonna put all you guys. You guys are will actually start on the uh, on the six with that roll. Uh, so let me get everyone there. Um, yeah, and this is. Uh, I don't know if you guys remember the chase mechanics, but yeah, we're doing a chase. Um, I, yeah, you guys should all be at full. Um, Whatchamacallit, full power points and everything. Okay. Cool. Um, 
But essentially, each card is uh, is five inches. For, you know, like measurement purposes and stuff. Um, and... Oh, yeah. Where is... Yeah. There we go. All right. So we shall get this started. Uh, basically... Quick refresher on the chase rules um, to advance for like the assumption is everybody is running. Uh, so to advance forward, you need to make a uh, an athletics check. Um, a success will let you move forward one. A raise will let you move forward two. Um, and you can still use like skills and like powers and whatnot as normal. Like it, you're you're going to be on combat initiatives, so it's a co it's basically a combat. But it's kind of weird where everything's laid out. Um, and I will add turns. Or not. Yeah, it's a battle it's a battle to toads uh, level. <laughs> yeah, level we're playing either. we're playing battle toads. <laughs> Alright. Uh, so Moroku, you got a joker. <laughs> what are you doing? Nice. You guys um, are coming down on this boar, a bunch of agamids are like right on your heels. <laughs> Can I use battle to give us an advantage? Uh, do you have the edge for that? or? Because uh, otherwise you can only give it to one person. I think I have natural leader. Did I do that? Oh yeah, you, you guys should be full on your PowerPoints, by the way. Right. Oh, I have Inspire. Yes. So inspire, I okay. Will, I will inspire everyone to pump their legs and and, uh, and <laughs> breathe, breathe uh, in through the nose to, to increase your running stamina. <laughs> so how does, the, uh, how does that edge work? Can you click the bubble so that'll post to chat or... Oh no! Or I can look it up. It's it's inspire. Or... Yeah, I didn't write any of the oh, information okay. in there. Oh okay. Well, I got but... it on the thing. So, and it's blank. Cool. <laughs> 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 Fucking god. <laughs> god damn it! Compendium that I paid money for. <laughs> uh, hold on. I got I got the book open. Let me. Yeah, I just want to see what the. Oh, god damn it. Plus, oh, I, it's a plus one to. Uh, I can give a plus one to every skill uh, to to everyone in a skill and plus two with a raise. So okay, and you got a plus two on that because of the Joker. Just so you know. Yeah. Um. I don't know if you wanted to try to Benny that for the raise. <laughs> sure. Does that last the whole combat? No, it's just. It's, I'm pretty sure it's just for the for the round. Yeah. Oh, one, yeah, once per turn. Okay. Oh, okay. Yeah, okay. I, yeah, I'm looking at it now. Okay, yeah. So, a bit, yeah, basically everyone's next athletics roll will get that bonus, right? Yeah. Okay. Um. Oh, and did you re-roll or... Oh, there it is. Yeah, everyone's got a plus two on athletics. All right. Nice. <laughs> nice. Uh, is that it for you, Moroku? <laughs> no? I'm the, you're catching up, right? Or yeah. Oh, yeah, no, I think on Chase you get a, th a free uh, maneuvering roll. Um, let me... Sorry, I, it's been a while <laughs> since I've done the Chase. Um, fucking goddamn it. Sorry, guys. <laughs> yeah, is it a single person is deemed, like, the pilot? Yeah. We're all on foot. Yeah, yeah, and like your maneuvering is your athletics role is like your your body is the vehicle. Um, well, I mean, each person can go f forward or backwards. Like, yeah, so you can get caught while the rest escape. Yeah, yeah. So I got either a ten or an eight if it needs a. Uh, uh yeah. So like a ten would be you move forward too. Um, oh, geez. Oh, maneuvers. Uh, 
Oh yeah, yeah. Change position is a free action. Um, if you do it as an action, it gives you a bonus to your roll. So yeah, you get a free you get a free attempt to change position every turn. Nice. So yeah. I'm on. I'm so, on. Yeah, it's you table. move up to. All right. Uh, I think that's it for you, right? Mm-hmm. All right, General. Um, <laughs> you see Moroku like, come on, guys, let's do this, and he fucking bolts out ahead of you after this boar. Yep. You're inspired because he's so lazy. <laughs> uh, everybody doubled uh, foot movement. <laughs> All right. Um, yeah, pace doesn't really come into play on this, so I'll just say that gives everyone another plus two on their maneuvering. Okay, and then I will athletics, so I got a total plus four. Can you only benefit from one raise, or would, or does the? Uh... Uh, yeah, you can only get the one. Jesus. <laughs> yeah, you can only get the, the up to the two. Um, up to the two, but <laughs> Jesus, dude. <laughs> so everyone is like speeded and running forward. Um, so that's it for you, Jamril. Yep. All right. Uh, the abnormally large. Oh yeah, this thing is fucking huge, by the way. Uh, <laughs> I, I didn't. Why, why are we trying to catch up with it? <laughs> <laughs> I've told you dinner. Yeah. Um, so it's like the still at you guys. Dinner? So it's gonna. <laughs> it's going to. Uh, it's gonna try to maneuver as an action and take the plus two. All right. Oh trip! And by that I mean actually trip. <laughs> oh God. Um, yeah, so the boar's gonna move ahead, too. <laughs> so you guys are, like, catching up on it. It, like, turns, it kind of turns its head and sees you and just, like, bolts. Uh, Gallus, you got a plus four in your athletics roll right now. <laughs> yeah, let's see how much that helps. Yeah. Ah, uh, that's two. So you're... <laughs> You're up on the you're up on the nine. Nice. Um, and you still got your regular action. I don't know that I have much I can do. Um, well, you have your taunts, right? All right? Yeah. True. Yeah, you could shake the thing. All right. Yeah, we'll give that a shot. And or make it like distracted, so it would have penalties on its next maneuver. Make it think that something's challenging it. It's like, hey, fucker. <laughs> oh, yeah, and he's going to roll smarts, right? Yeah. Yeah, that's awesome. <laughs> and it's an animal, so it doesn't really... Ah, uh, yeah, that's a success. So, uh, distracted or vulnerable? Uh, I forget what the difference is. Uh, distracted gives them a penalty on their actions. Vulnerable gives everyone a plus two against it. And those actions would include running, wouldn't it? Yep. Yeah, we'll go with the distracted. Keep it, keep All it right. slow. So, oh yeah, and it, this is a wild card, so it's got the bennies. Um, all right, uh, so I think that's it for you, Gallus. Uh, Agamid warrior type. This one's kind of well. So these are like actually groups of warriors. So I'm just treating them like wild cards, just because they're a bunch of people. <laughs> um, but yeah, let me make that roll, or rather, I'm giving them the the group check. Um, so yeah, they're just going to try to catch up, uh, do the athletics at plus two. All right. So he gets up to basically where a bunch of you guys are. Oh yeah. I gave them all separate. All right. Uh, Drake in Europe. Uh, uh I'm a run. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I'm be there. <laughs> all right. Uh, Athletics at plus four. Yep, so you're, you're up on the nine. <laughs> uh, and I don't really have anything else I can do unless I can run again. So. No, no, you can only do that once per turn. Unfortunately. And you're not a tabaxi. Is it close enough to throw my? Is it too big for my weighted net? Ah, uh... bother it. No, I think it that would work because it's uh, it's it's ten away from you, because it's or no, sorry, it's fifteen away from you. 
Can you treat it as like weirdly shaped bellows? <laughs> I I would say yes. Your net would work on the animal, because this is like the type of shit it's made for. Cool. Uh, it's in the, I don't remember. It's an athletics rule. For yeah, it, right? to throw. Yeah, if you want to be a if you want to be a throwing <laughs> you can basically oh, do like a sneak. Yeah, I think that'll <laughs> hit. <laughs> I'm pretty sure that's a raise, even if that's out of uh, if there's a range penalty on that. Nice. Uh, yeah, because net. What's the range on a net? Net weighted. Uh. Oh shit! You're throwing that at long range because it's uh it's got a max range of twelve. Oh, that's right. I forgot how close it was. Yeah. So that's gonna be. Minus four it would be. No, insane. like it's it's at extreme range, so it's like. Oh. Yeah. I don't know if you can throw at extreme. So yeah, it might not actually be in range yet. Okay. Sorry. <laughs> um. Well, let's see. What else could you do? Uh, sorry, I was trying to find the cheat sheet for the chase. I was like, oh yeah, I actually don't fucking remember the rules. <laughs> um, but yeah, you could. Uh, so you did change position. Oh yeah, and then Shippo, you did get the you did get a uh, a complication with the spade, um, but yeah, I think yeah, uh, but yeah, Chris, if you can attack, I think you could just do evade as a free action, which would give things a penalty to hit you. Okay, I'll do that. Or uh, what is it? Or or you could do hold steady. <laughs> or oh yeah, yeah, that would be like you could do like the aim maneuver. Oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah, but that won't really work. Because that doesn't have any benefit for him since he has to... Since right, has to okay, move. yeah, you can't, right. Cause, yeah, so let's go aim. back to evade. Okay, so yeah, you're just evading. Um, all right. And then Shippo, you got the club and what, you're on the hearts. So hearts are... Uh, Okay, so you you need to make a maneuver. Yeah, there's like a complication. So make a, just make a regular. Yeah, make an athletics check. Um, this isn't for moving. This is for avoiding the complication. All right, so you're fine on the complication. Um, okay. Now do whatever you were doing. Um, and yeah, you have a. I think you got the got the plus four still. Nice. All right. All right. Wow. Lame. Wow. All right. <laughs> so you get up to the 10. <laughs> I'm going to attempt to... Uh... I should probably get some, like, fighting music going, huh? Or chase stuff instead of the serene singing <laughs> lady. <laughs> <laughs> oh, sorry, guys. It's all good. I'm trying to make this all... Oh, here we go. Let's do the. I want to use thievery to test him, attempting to blind him by like catching the sun with something shiny and getting him in the eye. <laughs> the old pocket sand defense. <laughs> yeah. All right, go for it. Oh man. Uh, so what is that? Thievery is agility. Yes. All right. So I'll roll his agility. Oh, wow. Uh, yeah, that'll shake him. And, um, oh, yeah, we're doing the uh, creative combat, right? So, okay, he's shaking. <laughs> um, and, yeah, since he's uh, that would also make him vulnerable. Um, since he's also... Uh, shit, where is shaking? Where are you shaking? There we go. All right. <laughs> uh, is that it for Shippo? Yeah. You know, like, distracting the fucking... <laughs> <laughs> Fantastic. Uh, she has no pennies, because she spent them already. Um, but she is going to try to 
Catch up with you fools. If her character sheet will load. There we go. Athletics. Plus four. Zoom. Alright. Catches up with y'all. Um, I so fast. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah. I think she's just going to try to fucking shoot the thing with an arrow. gonna kapew ooh that is a raise uh, and <laughs> oh god uh... <laughs> Jesus nice what the fuck <laughs> how much is that That's 38 38 but she have the Patriot arrow on her <laughs> <or something>? apparently <laughs> She's like, don't worry, guys, I got this. Uh, I get another shot. Yeah, so that would be, that. that's four wounds. Jesus, dude. Uh, so, yeah, definitely going to spend a Benny to soak. Uh, <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> Sorry, guys, the NPC almost finished the encounter for you. <laughs> oh, no, that's terrible. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. Nope, Benny. The, nope, we're not. <laughs> All right. <laughs> so, still two wounds on this thing. <laughs> um, yeah, I'll spend one of my bennies for that. <laughs> it's like, come on. Yeah. This is not how this is ending. <laughs> does, the soak, do, does the minus two also go for the soak or just to, uh, or when it's distracted? Does that, uh... Oh, shit. All right. Yep, that does apply to the soak roll. So, that's only... So yeah, it has three wounds. <laughs> um, Got it. Yeah, holy shit. Um, when does the uh, when does does because this thing is uh, is size four, so it's large. Does that have the? Does that give it's it the one extra, extra wound? Okay, yeah. So it does have the one. All right. So yeah, this one can take four wounds. All right. Cool. Ah, uh, so Jesus. <laughs> ah, that's pretty great. Uh, all right, so Agamid warriors are getting left behind here, so <laughs> they're just gonna try to catch up again. Uh, so spending their whole turn new athletics. All right, so that one gets up too, and the second one. Will do all right, yeah. So the next two, they both. They're both. Uh, basically caught up with you yeah all right and audits <laughs> oh you you have a club so you gotta give me a maneuvering roll so roll athletics yeah that was based off of the no the it's if you it's the... on your initiative and then what the complication is is on the chase card mm. yeah uh so you're fine um cool. now do your athletics to move forward Actually, did I get? Well, I, it didn't matter if I got a plus two or not. But yeah. I was assuming I got a plus. Yeah, two. Yeah, you have a plus like, four all together because yeah. you also have a speed uh, buff. Um, oh, okay. so, so that will give you an eight. So you'll catch up with everyone. Cool. Um. So yeah. So you're there. Um. And then yeah, you still can take your action. Uh. I guess I'm. <laughs> you you just be... watched Kadia stick a fucking arrow like right <laughs> dead on dead center of this fucking thing. <laughs> Yeah, I'm gonna greater telekinesis it. <laughs> oh, <God. laughs> All right. I do not have 113. I have 13 power points. Left. <laughs> <laughs> so um, here's the focus roll. Sorry, do I have any bonuses to that? I don't think so. Um, but yeah, okay. the four will activate it at the normal amount, so that whatever strength yeah. that gives you. Yeah, with uh, greater telekinesis, that is a D12 okay. plus two. No, that's per raise. So just a D12. Yeah. Um, and so you're going to try to wrestle the thing? Yeah. Try to pick it up. So do I just make a D12 roll? or? Um, oh, I think he rolls against your your focus. So, well, uh, 
I think that's not right. Hold on, sorry. Oh, it to... just it it it's against the strength because it is yeah. okay. Sorry, I'm I'm looking right. up the powers real quick. No, so I'm going to comment for this caster's arcane skill with a post spirit roll when targeted at this. Okay, turn. yeah. So he makes a post spirit uh, spirit roll against your four there. Um, so yeah, I'll mm -hmm. do that with the. But it's a boar, so it probably. Uh, so oh, post night work. <laughs> Uh, Jesus. Oh. That's with his wounds. Um, but, uh, did you want to re-roll that, or did you... Uh, yeah. Oh, you got no bennies. <laughs> yeah, I used them all in the previous all right. thing. Uh, yeah, so you try to you try to grab onto him with your with your TK, but you just fucking can't get a good grip. Like, it, it's, it's, it's just, like, frenzying... Like, you cannot get your mind arms around it. Also, isn't that 8 uh, actually a 6 with the distracted? Uh, it is actually a 6, but he still beats your 4. Yeah. Oh, bummer. Yeah. Oh, yeah, it's not. Okay, it didn't. Weird, it list distracted. Yeah. All right. Uh, so I think that's it for that round. So, new initiative. <laughs> Ah, uh, Draken, you are up first. So uh, yeah, you only have a Draken. plus two on athletics now since you've done the the inspire already uh, kicked, but you still have the speed boost. Ah, uh, so that'll let you get one closer. Now is that one square or one card? One card. Yeah, so that'll that'll put you in net range, but you're still at long range, so that'll be a minus four. I also have a crossbow. Okay. Yeah, you also. Just I didn't realize we could just shoot it. So yeah, like you're hunting it. So. <laughs> uh. Oh yeah, what's the range on the crossbow? Um. Ten, twenty, forty. Okay, so you're you're at medium then, right? Yeah, because it's oh no, ten. You're in ten. It's within, okay. yeah. Yeah, so that is a raise. Yeah, so roll your damage. Uh, so that's eleven altogether. Uh, let me see. And then yeah, you have AP on that because that does matter. Uh, yeah, AP two. All right, so that is eleven damage. AP two. Uh. Oh, it is shaken. So normally that would be enough to wound it, but it unfortunately has Hardy. <laughs> I'm gonna spend a Benny and reroll. Yeah, try to <laughs> get better bonus damage on that. Ah, uh, 15. All right. Ah, uh, yeah, that would be enough for a wound then, because that's. Yeah, because yeah, it's a raise over what he got. Yeah, the last that's time. literally four. All right, all right. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, you give it another wound. Um, I think, I'll, yeah, it's gonna try to soak with its last Benny though. Uh, but he's got a negative on it because of the wounds and distracted and everything. Uh, but nope. All right, you wound it. Uh, so it's got four wounds. It's not looking very good. <laughs> uh, Moroku You're up You just saw Draken stick the thing with a crossbow Ah, <laughs> uh, yeah <laughs> That's two With the wind tunnel Wind tunnel <laughs> Oh god <laughs> You're hitting it with magicalness. Ah, uh, so yeah, that will activate. Uh oh. <laughs> Spending the, spend the Benny. <laughs> On the initial roll or the damage? Oh, the damage. Okay. <laughs> All right, uh, so 14, uh, let's see. 
this thing has pretty crazy toughness just because it's fucking large. And uh, uh six yeah. AP. Oh, that has six AP. Okay. Yeah. So yeah, that's enough to wound it. So you fucking <laughs> you just like run up and blast this thing with wind and yeah. <laughs> it tumbles, bangs its head against a rock, and goes unconscious. <laughs> <laughs> Congratulations. You got your boar. Um, and yeah, the the other Agamids, they, they ca eventually catch up with you and they like pull out their spears and they start, you know, stabbing the boar to get their their spear hits in. <laughs> um, but yeah, you guys successfully defeated the hunt. Um nice. But yeah, we are. That hard, bit... Geralt. What's that? <laughs> Got that hard, Geralt. <laughs> Geralt. Yeah. That's dinner the wild time. hunt. <laughs> yes, it is dinner time. Um, we are a bit over our usual time, so I think I'm gonna call it here, and uh, we can continue with the post Great Hunt festivities next time. Sounds good. So, hope you guys had fun going through all of the trials and tribulations of a of an Agamid becoming a man. <laughs> <laughs> you now, yeah, we now have the right to have, have puberty. Woo! Yay! <laughs> Alright, I gotta run anyway. Thanks, guys. Alrighty. Yeah. See you later. See, See you later. Thanks for watching all three people on the internet. Have a hey, good night. That's better than the last time. <laughs> I don't. I, that's like I, all the people on the internet. That's like history. all the people. I don't know. I don't think I have any viewers, but it's fine. Bye. <laughs>